Hey everybody, it's Lawrence, and because I get this question all the time, I just want to say once again, uh, if you're asking the question, are you normal sexually, the answer to the question is, if you are an adult human who feels sexual things in your body and gets turned on by all kinds of things, yes, you are normal, because it is normal for adult mammals to feel lots of sexual energy and lots of turn on and to want to have sex because that is, if there's one fundamental unifying thing to human mammals is sex is the thing. Without sex, we don't have life. So therefore, it is truly one of the, if not the most important drive that there is. It is involved in pretty much every interaction that there is. And if you're a woman and you're like wondering, like, what does this guy want from me? What he wants is sex. We all want to have sex. We want to communicate and connect and feel depth and, and, and get to know you. And one of the most powerful tools for doing that is sex. But here's the thing. I understand that is not just about sex, but it's also about good sex, connected sex, because just putting point A inside of slot B and doing some jackhammering is not going to make you anybody feel fulfilled. It will help you sneeze, but in terms of connection depth, feeling that connectedness, developing intimacy and vulnerability, if you're just doing, you know, essentially porn set sex, just this point, just bah, 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 back and forth, jackhammer sex, you know, you're just not gonna, those aren't gonna be the satisfying things. But here's the thing, start to broaden your palette, start to be curious about what your turn-ons really are. What is it you really wanna do? And is this something that you're willing to be vulnerable and talk about with your partner? Suppose you like feet. Could you say, hey, you know what? I have been wanting to talk about this. I wanna have a, uh, I wanna talk to you about my desire and, uh, and you know, just have an adult conversation about some things that I'm interested in exploring. What about you? And so it's a great way to start to expand your palette, discover what turns you on, tap your sexuality, tap into your pleasure, and share that with another human being. I really encourage you to do that. There is another video which I will cover what I call the more difficult conversations video. This comes directly from my friend Reed, and it's a really great formula for learning how to have a, a communication about something that you desire, that you really want, but you're afraid to ask for. So until next time, this is Lawrence, and I wanna thank you for joining me today, and I look forward to seeing you in the next video.